Hey guys, this is my first tutorial and I'm not very good at English. So if I say something wrong, please laughing about it or post it in the comments so that I can learn it. Let's start with my elephant or Irina fan. I named it so because a friend called Irina got it for birthday. Whatever. This paper is about 25 centimeters. If you want a smaller elephant, you have to choose smaller paper. I think the smaller the elephant is, the cooler it looks. So, let's start. First, fold the paper in half. Rotate the paper and fold this edge to that edge. Turn the model over and repeat. Open the model again so that the mountain fold is in the middle. Now fold this tip to that crease starting at this point. Well, and only crease at the right up to this crease. Open it again and fold the creases we've done at the beginning. Now you can push this layer up and turn this mountain fold into a valley fold and then close the model up. Notice that this tip is nice. So, turn the model over, fold this edge to that edge and look at this edge that it's nice. Fold, unfold, so, and repeat as behind. Push this up and reverse fold this edge. Uh, make this valley for a uh, mountain fold into a valley fold and close the model again. It's not very nice here because I fold and talk. English. So now we make this at the right side, fold from this point to that point. You can make it without pre creasing, but I think it's easier for you with pre crease. Open it again and reverse fold as shown. So, repeat behind, I show you without pre-creasing, so, like this. Then you have to reverse fold these two edges. You can pre-crease it like that with a mountain f uh, with a valley fold and open it again and reverse fold it. Then you have to reverse fold this edge. Open this layer and fold this edge to this, this edge. And at the other side, and close it again. Turn the model over and repeat. Make a valley fold, 
open it again, reverse fold it, and reverse fold this edge. And close it. So now you open this triangle and fold like this. Turn the model over and do it again at this side. Open and close like this. Now you open the model at the bottom, turn it over and fold this tip to that tip. Open it again, turn the model over and you have to pleat it. You make a valley fold from this point to that point and pleat it. So. Now you have to swivel fold the legs. Um, Open this layer and fold like this. And notice that here is a 90 degrees angel. So it's like this. That's the other side. Open here. this edge to that edge and swivel. So now we close the model again and open this leg. Now you have to make a here's a valley fold and you have to make a valley fold like this a little bit near that point so you open this leg and make a new valley fold so and now squash that leg so that the tip is like that so that this is a line. Turn the model over and repeat on this side. Open the leg, make a valley fold, new valley fold like this. And squash the leg. Now you open the model again and fold the tail inside as far as possible. And now you fold this tail back at not the half, a quarter, something like a quarter. You fold it back again. I have no reference point for this. Now uh, you fold this edge to the middle line and swivel it. And at the other side fold this edge to the middle line and swivel. Looks 
like this. Now you close the elephant again, make a mountain fault and another mountain fault here and shape the leg. Repeat on the other side two mountain faults like this. Now this are the ears. Uh, open it and you have to make a valley fold at this crease line and at the other side. So open the model here, make two valley folds and push it together here at the trunk and um, close it. Notice that this crease line aligned with the legs and make it flat. like this. So I open it again. Valley folds, push it and make it flat. Now we open the ears. Don't fold it, just open and fold that tip to that edge, close it again and repeat on the other side. Open the ear and fold it like this and close again. Now we make the ears 3D. You have to make a valley fold here and now you have something like a triangle here and you divide this triangle into half something like this and you get a 3D ear. Now lock this ear, open the layer and lock it. There are no reference points. Ah. Turn the model over and repeat. Make a ready fold here. And divide the triangle in half. And lock it again. It's not very nice. But I hope you understand what I mean. So, now we fold the trunk. We make a double rabbit ear. 
starting the mountain forts like this. So and at the other side so we open it and fold the rabbit ears all mountain falls so it looked like this and like this and now we push it together and upside and close it and make it flat and now we can shape the trunk like this now we can shape the back and make it 3D so and that that is is it hope you enjoy this video and can follow my instructions Please comment and say what I can make better or what you want to say. Give a thumb up if you like the video. Yeah, have a nice day and now it's your turn. See you.